Hello everybody and welcome to another video preview brought to you by Sound Auction Service of May 27th Antiques and Collectibles Auction at 5 p.m. We have a lot of great stuff this week so I'm gonna get right down into it. We have this musical kaleidoscope native wedding pottery bowl this bronze reindeer metal windmill sculpture, some vintage necklaces, vintage cameras, binoculars, these nice party bowl set here, Italian hand painted turkeys, this nightstand and glass and pitcher, vintage teapot, hourglass, shadow box butterflies, art glass, paperweight ornament, Toby mug, old porcelain dogs, Wilder Little House complete set it looks like possibly oh no no that's not a complete set but it's a large set of Wilder books this cool pewter what is that uh, pewter plate coat of arms type of deal this handcrafted hand-painted Mexican pottery these fairy statues, Princess Diana commemorative postal set, probably stamps, vases, a lot of this stuff's really old, came from a beautiful estate, um, vintage linens and doilies with mohair, um, this Homer Laughlin mixing bowl, We'll go around here. We have some cranberry glass stemware. This knife, Keith and Smith sharpening station. Viewmaster with slides. Art glass bird. This Apollo stopwatch. It does work. And this is pretty cool. I'm going to come around the front. This wind up Simca rhinestone clock. Um. Some colorful stemware. A lot of these have good names on them too. I can't remember all the names, so just keep an eye out. Hopefully, you come into preview. There's some great items this week. This beautiful spiral cut vase here, that's great. Decanter, some signed pottery. Oh, I like this <laughs> chef mug, handmade. It's like a chef smoking. Russian nesting dolls. Blue glaze pottery, miniature sat iron, this Ethan Allen sculpture. I didn't know Ethan Allen made a sculpture, but there you go, right there. Um, some Asian, like, sake cordials. I don't know, they're pretty cool. Old silver ole liquor decanters, some Fenton art glass, some old pottery figurines, some copper luster ware. Some nice ice buckets and martini mixer, some more Italian decanter and um, cut crystal, cut glass, some anniversary clocks, some great old tins and handcrafted inlaid box, this pearlized silverware leaf dish, some more great vanity items. This Thomas Kincaid item there. Some Asian items. Pink Depression. Some great vanity mirrors and brushes. Got a nice uh, step ladder. Some candelabras and candlestick holders. Concrete water fountain. Some great cranberry art glass. Old pieces here. And this is a derby from the 18th century, seven, or 19th century, it's early, mid 1800s. Some old ceramic pottery Victorian planters. Some more cranberry art glass. A bunch of costume jewelry and other 
fine jewelry. Great vintage pieces. This lady had a massive collection of vintage and antique items. We have a Sanyo mini fridge, lectern, folding table, skill saw table, sawzall, chainsaw, step ladder, aluminum box, rustic shop utility chest, a concrete bird bath. This thing's cool. Look at that. We have this trundle day bed and some great hand quilted or handmade, hand stitched quilts. You can't really see this right now, but there's also a nice nine drawer dresser back there. That dresser's not for sale. Uh, we've got a nice wheelchair here. Some great rugs, area rugs. Just pan a little bit so you can see all these. This primitive burlwood table here. Some old plates. A lot of these have great names. Be sure to come in and preview. My battery's running dead, so I gotta kinda hurry. Um, some great artwork, some beautiful original artwork. Lots of great fabrics. Gonna do them by the shelf. Hopefully you can see all that. Some nice old sewing machines. This one, the casters on it are cool. They're like, kind of look like the closet rods were drilled out and then turned into wheels. <laughs> and this mirror is incredible. It's beautifully gilded mirror here. And we got this other iron and grape mirror here. Industrial sewing machine by Singer. Lots of patterns, vintage patterns. Another vintage trundle sewing machine here. And some horse figurines. Some of these are Heartland. My uncle found some that were Heartland. Whether they're in crazy expensive or not, I'll leave that up to you. Backgammon game board. This little sofa table. Some liquor decanters. Sombreros. Some German Steins, some wicker baskets, some unique ones. Got some outdoor kids' toys, wine rack, nice little Victorian style wall shelf, and some crystal candlestick holders, some antique dolls. Can't really see them, but there's some great old dolls in here. Solid brass uh, brandy snifters. Vintage AM FM cassette radio and this red enamel or roaster. It's got some weird handles. Handles are in weird positions. It's kind of cool. There's also this like uh, Etagere. Etagere. <laughs> it's kind of cool. And then this rifle cabinet. It looks to be homemade. Very nice though, with accessories. It's a nice mid-century um, dresser. Schlitz beer sign. Here's a nice wall mirror also. I like that. Some Indiana like carnival glass pitchers. Grape harvest pattern. Got the blue and purple or what's that? The electric purple I think it's called. And this green. And let's see, oh, we got lots of cool eagle figurines. So you can see all those, and horse figurines. Some rare aluminum cookware, like miniature cookware. And this cool original abstract painting. It's mine, so I wouldn't even come for that. <laughs> There's uh, some Fire King, some Carnival Glass. These old aluminum, like lunch canisters, Easy Rider magazines, some miniature tea sets. Hopefully, you can see these. These things are tiny too, they're cool. All porcelain, well made. And we have this 
Sunbeam Mix Master with mixing bowls and all the attachments, it works. And also these mixing bowls here are also Sunbeam, separate lot. KitchenAid, or no, excuse me, Hamilton Beach 14 speed mixer. Some self-help, self-analysis books. Some walkie-talkies and GPS. Some great carnival glass, iridescent glass. Some nice Pyrex mixing nesting bowls. Double egg trays. And we actually have another one of these that will be coming out. They're like quilted jewelry boxes, vintage quilted jewelry boxes. Lots of Beanie Babies, some Calkeen satin sheet sets. Um, some great tea set there and some plates and bowls in China. Some nice canisters. Some fine china, Japanese fine china. I forget the exact pattern. It's like Royal Elegance pattern. Some nice Mojolica plates and others. Some more and more. And some Mikasa. Some acrylic like ice candlestick holders. And these are blue, but in the light, they shine like a beautiful purple and these are pink but in the light they shine like a blue I don't know it's kind of wicked oh I like these these are margarita they're handcrafted hand painted beautiful margarita and um, martini glasses we have some large Chinese vases some sterling candlestick holders and salt and peppers some satin glass and possibly Fenton, Westmoreland. Mary Gregory hand painted art glass base pictures. Uh, some yellow glasses, kind of cool looking. Some blue cobalt. Plant stand with planter. Uh, oh, it's a Kenmore dishwasher portable <laughs> and that is about it we're not going to be doing much off catalog we're going to try to go through what's in the gallery for the most part in a couple weeks we will be selling a large chunk of off catalog where it'll just be so any of our off catalog people please keep an eye out for that next week we have a fantastic auction of great antiques and collectibles if you thought what you saw in the video was good, there's better next week. So keep an eye out for that. Uh, please like, comment, and share.